cells. They're important. They make up you. You know what's also important? Your household. These might be bad analogies, but we're going for function. So, the walls. It isn't the cell walls, believe it or not. To me, the walls is the cytoskeleton. The, the cytoskeleton is made up of multiple parts. It has different... Uh, um, has microtubules, intermediate filaments, and microfilaments. And a wall has support beams, plastering, and another thing that I don't know what it's called. Three parts to a wall, three parts to a cytoskeleton. A generator. Not quite n mitochondria, but more of a, a nucleus of sorts. The reason why I say this is because generator, it controls the amount. You know how the, in the power outages, more annoying it's because the power is what keeps the house going you remove the power the house essentially shuts down so i i know it sounds like a mitochondria but the nucleus has to stay alive so does the generator if you want the house to function endoplasmic reticulum I associate these with wires. Why? Well, data transfers through wires, like the wires through my microphone, the wires through my headphone. It's different data, but each wire is for something different. You can't send audio in through an audio out cable, same way you can't charge your phone using an audio cable. You need a phone cord for your phone. You can't use your computer cord, or it doesn't work. Each wire is for different data. Insulation, or the ribosomes. Insulation, I don't know about you, but I like it. It keeps me warm, keeps me cool, prevents the elements from getting past the wall. Ribosomes also protect the ER. It works better with the wire analogy. If you had two crossing wires, well, those wires wouldn't work. That's why they get insulated. That's how I see it. Golgi apparatus with the breaker. Golgi apparatus prepares each molecule for where it needs to go. The breaker. You send too much electricity to one place, it breaks. Electricity needs to be tightly managed. Same with those molecules. Otherwise, you'll have a dysfunctional cell. And that's qu not quite good, I don't think. I mean, dysfunctional cells? That's cancerous. Vesicles I see as timers. Mainly, well, vesicles are short-lived. Timers, I don't know about you, but they can be short-lived a lot. Timers are created as needed. Vesicles are generally short-lived and are formed and recycled as needed. They live and die for a very short period of time. Fridge, mitochondria. I did say this wasn't all in the same analogy, did I? Food. That's fridge. You mainly associate where you get your energy from with food, and I see food with the fridge. So mitochondria is where food comes from. I messed up. Hold on. Mitochondria creates the energy that you, the cell needs to live. Fridge holds the food that we need in order for us to live. There we go. It wasn't that hard. Vacuole. It's a storage compartment. Cabinets are storage. Simple as that. Vacuole is Latin for cabinet. <laughs> no, it isn't. That was a bad joke. Lysosomes are cells' defendants. Doors. I don't know about you, but if you do it right, you can defend yourself from a bad guy with a shotgun. It worked for a bit. You just gotta figure out where the gun is and not stand there just kidding but someone charges at you just slam a door in their face out in an is two by fours they keep you supported with basic stuff i once built a deck out of two by fours it was great two by fours centriol centrosomes not centrioles centrosomes centrosomes are those basic support now centrioles are the big support beams. They're, they're made out of all the small support beams. 
out of all those two by fours, those centrosomes. But the centrosomes are this and are in the two by fours. Those make up the centrioles and the support beams. Hey everyone, thanks for watching. Sorry for putting you through that cringe. Well, it definitely was cringe, especially that cancer joke. I, I did not say that to make fun of anyone with cancer. Just, I did this entire thing unscripted and it came to mind. Sorry. Anyway, as you can tell, not for kids. So, Kappa, get out.